We have learned more secrets about the Tesla Cybertrucks as they are exposed in a patent application, uh, the electric trucks UI and other upcoming features we have yet to see are already revealed. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here for the first time, please subscribe to our uh, uh, channel for daily Tesla and electric vehicle news and also ring the bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story. The Tesla Cybertruck unveiled, uh, unveiling head for lack of better word, some unexpected events, right? Simon Alvarez in Tesla Radi saying even Elon Musk himself admitted that he lost a lot Lot of his uh, rhythm after the vehicle's now infamous failed armor glass demonstration. The failed demo resulted in much of the later part of the Cybertruck's unveiling getting a bit rushed, save for Tesla's ATV. Much of the Cybertruck's accessories were not discussed at all. This does not mean that the Cybertruck is lacking in accessories and equipment, however. A look at Tesla's concept images for the vehicle showed that the electric vehicle maker is at least looking to release several novel accessories and products that would complement the Cybertruck. These include a tent with a stove, some cool bed rails, and a massive full-sized futuristic trailer that looked like it had enough space to be a tiny house. Details about Tesla's trailer, which was fondly called by some electric vehicle fans as the cyber living trailer, were scarce. Just like the Cybertruck's other accessories, the massive contraption existed only as a cool concept image. Elon Musk, however, noted back in March that the Cybertruck could power a tiny house such as those that could be pulled by a truck. This was cool but quite expected considering that the Cybertruck is expected to have a massive battery pack. Thankfully, a patent about the Tesla Cybertruck's UI has provided what appears to be some teasers about the futuristic trailer. Illustrations from the patent, um, which seemed to be screenshots from the Cybertruck's UI, included an image showing a video feed from the pickup's rear camera as it was being attached to a trailer based on uh, the figures on the patent. For example, take a look at figure 8a in the patent. The link of the patent I will have in the description of this video. So. Um, uh, 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 based on figure A, the Cybertruck's futuristic trailer seems to be quite massive. Interestingly enough, not Simon Alvarez in Tesla, but the figure 8B in the patent of the Cybertruck's UI featured the pickup as it was pulling the trailer on the road. The image included a rather interesting detail with the upper part of the UI stating that the Cybertruck was pulling 20,000 pounds. Whether this 20,000 pound load was the massive cyber willing, cyber living trailer was not specified in the patent's image, but the fact that the pickup could pull such a load, 20,000 pounds, is impressive nonetheless. Now, some people I read in comments saying that Tesla may put these impressive numbers in the patent in order to kind of uh, surprise or uh, compete with other legacy truck makers. Uh, I don't know, but I think 20,000 pound load is, is very in impressive nonetheless. Now, a potential 20,000 pound trailer could open the door for luxury campers that are based uh, that are best used by families that love glamping, uh, right? Simon Alvarez in Tesla Radi saying campers at this class typically include a king size bed and actual living room, a full kitchen and a spacious bathroom with a tub such as the DRV luxury suite 44 Memphis. If Tesla could release a similar camper with the same weight and amenities as traditional campers in the 20,000 pound range, then the electric vehicle maker could end up disrupting yet another segment. Tesla's Cybertruck UI patent could be viewed in the description of this video. Now, friends, I have been looking at um, some comments in the social media and saw some of them saying uh, literally the following. So let's take a look at some of these comments. 
comments. One person says a structure floor battery option for the trailer, please, so that it can be used as tender for the towing vehicle. It's an obvious thing to do. Another person says the trailer illustrated during the track intro was a small single axle fifth wheeler. The one at the top of this article uh, in this article is that I mentioned here is more and mid-sized twin axle trailer. You have been seeing pictures as a background for this uh, uh, podcast, but seems well matched to the half ton Cybertruck. Neither qualifies as massive or huge or anything like that, says one person. Another person says it would change the slightly shadowed tiny house on wheels world saying uh, surely basically if cybertruck puts it's a trailer like that that would change the shadowy tiny house on wheels world surely that person says adding but a better notion would be to build a tiny house on the cybertruck chassis if it had a chassis okay cast a cyber home or cyber truck uh, wheels and less uh, let self-driving make it amazing basically you will have if you put a cyber home on the type of cyber truck chassis you will have self-driving home i think another person says hope and hope that the cyber truck will really shine when both Cybertruck and Ford F-150 electric vehicle Lightning are actually produced and used. Ford, Ford seems to have given little thought to aerodynamics while Tesla has. The Cybertruck will destroy traditional uh, gas trucks in power, performance, range, aerodynamics, durability, and safety. No wonder Ford is rushing to get the Lightning EV truck out the Ford's F-150 truck out. Now, other person says for under a 100 miles, it should be good. So perfect for most work and weekend boating in the lake. Um, if you put a home on the top of Cybertruck, cross country camping, uh, cross country camping trips, not so much with 100 miles range. However, with um, with pulling superchargers, fast charging speed, that may be doable. He says, I will need minimum 200 miles range for both towing on my Cybertruck. If the EPA estimate range is 600 plus, that should um, be good as well. Now, the most interesting piece of information in the images that you've been seeing about this Cybertruck UI is the fact that it is consistently showing a range of 610 miles for the Cybertruck, the Cybertruck alone itself. When when Tesla unveiled the Cybertruck, it announced that the top performance version would have a range of over 500 miles. Therefore, it is not impossible that it could end up having 610 miles of range, but that would be a very optimistic look at the electric pickup truck. The UI images also give us a look at possible new Cybertruck accessories like the deployable camper kitchen that I just mentioned. Uh, CEO Elon Musk already said that the Tesla Cybertruck is going to be offered with kind of quote unquote sick attachments and accessories. The Tesla Cyber Quad, an all electric ATV, has already been confirmed as an option for Cybertruck buyers, but a trailer specifically designed for Cybertruck has also been rumored. Um, well, friends, let me know what do you think about this new patent application. In this new patent application, the images show the user interface of the Cybertruck in towing mode with a trailer. In one image, for example, it references towing a trailer of up to 20,000 pounds that I said, which is about twice the announced rated towing capacity of the Cybertruck. And um, you have been seeing some images on your screen. It's unclear, says Electric, if any of those specs are potentially the ones Tesla aims to achieve for the production version of just or just random specs for the user interface design. So what do you think? Do you think Tesla is going to use this as a production version? Um, now, Tesla aims to bring the Cybertruck to market by the end of this year. The mass production will start next year, but you know, uh, the initial production and some people will be delivered by the end of this year. And Tesla has taken already some serious steps to do that, but it has indicated that deliveries could slip to 2022. So we'll have to be patient, wait and see. The electric pickup truck starts at 40,000 
dollars as you know but the base version is coming later tesla is going to start deliveries with the dual motor and tri-motor versions of the vehicle which start at fifty thousand dollars and seventy thousand dollars respectively and we learned recently that ford is bringing its lightning f-150 electric truck as well and there's going to be other competitors like uh, hammer ev and rivians r1t so friends let me know what you think about cyber trucks uh, mileage uh, this patent user um, uh, uh, user application and ui and so on this is armin haria from torquenews.com have a great day everyone subscribe to our channel for more tesla news and share in social media like this video if it was helpful please and i'll see you soon in our next report god bless you and peace be with all of you everyone